I'm here at Ship and Valves. I've just invested in seven new machines from Ward High Tech. I'm going to talk to Paul and Byron about why they bought this new H and K and what they love about it. You obviously chose to buy the H and K, but obviously Ward High Tech, they're the dealers. What's the relationship between yourselves and Ward High Tech? Uh, well, years ago when we we had a, a machine shop back in 2000, uh, we invested in some, some new machinery at the time, uh, some smaller lathes, etc. Uh, and through Ward High Tech, that deal was possible. So we've had quite a long running relationship with them. Uh, when, I, when I sort of looked around at machines, I looked at more than one, one uh, supplier. But the, the machines that Ward High Tech are now selling, which is their Hawachins, uh, are very robust machines, especially the VTL. Uh, great turning capacity, small floor space, same with the lathes, you know, they, they really do perform well. Everything that we've bought from them, I think, has gone really well. Uh, the, the bar feed machine, in particular, again, with the Y-axis and twin spindles, is a phenomenal machine for it, for it to get going uh, and, and, and rapid response. So how does the HNK fit with all the other machines on your shop floor? Well, currently we have a, we're having a medium-sized machine that will do up to about our 12-inch valves. The, the, the HNK will do everything 12 inch and above, up to as, as big as we can get. As I said, standard 24 inch, certain types of valves up to 42 inch. But the way we've laid the factory out and rejigged everything and now we've got the machines in, it all, it all goes through really in a better flow. So it does give you the capability of dropping down to a size. Uh, and then uh, again, with, with the other machine we've got, we can, we can sort of use utilize seven pallets we've got to do our different types of work. So again, if we have a medium size uh, set of valves on a big project or something like that, we can always have the option of transferring it over to the HNK. So it's actually, even though the HNK from Ward High Tech is a specialist machine, it's actually, you can, you can, it's quite versatile. You can put yeah, different the, parts I mean, on it. It's all part of what we looked at when we put this together as a business. Obviously, versatility is crucial. Uh, extra capacity, when you're over capacity in one area, you know, the, the, the idea is to, to come up with a better solution and be able to transfer work around from one machine to the other. Uh, I think these two machines that we've got all fit perfectly together and I think it's a really good asset for the company going forward. So just so we've had seven machines, we've got some layers, some mills, okay. big vertical borer, and we're now yeah. getting a few big machines coming in, this HNK. Yeah, yeah. How, um, how is that going to change the way you work on the shop floor? It's just going to give us so much more control uh, and the freedom to be able to, to push whatever we need through, um, you know, as and when we need it. There's a lot of delays, you know, in, in, the, in the line with castings. You know, you always have problems in engineering, so it just gives us that freedom to be able to, to problem solve, you know, but straight sort of on the ground. So it's all about bringing control in-house? Yeah, this is it. Um, I think, obviously, it's, it's going to take machining costs down massively as well. Um, you know, I mean, it's great for the guys to be able to have the progression as well from the smaller machines onto the larger machines. You know, it's great for them. I did the same thing myself when I started, and uh, I've never looked back. So. What has the machine installation been like? Up to now, it's been challenging. Uh, not, not so much with the actual machine itself. It's all, all the bits that nobody normally sees that that goes under the machine so uh, the concrete and rebar yeah, and threaded rod all, and whatnot all, all that sort of thing but what about the support from from ward high tech while you're doing this quite challenging process yeah i mean they've, they've been brilliant they've, they've been through every step of the way with us looking from tooling to fixtures to jigging we've worked with several different companies outside of water high tech through them to get to get us up to speed with everything that we need to get the machine up and running uh, they have been there all the time all the way through it we knew roughly when the, the machine was going to land, uh, 10 months to actually build it in the factory, which is, is quite some time. And then obviously to get it here as well was another couple of months. So we're, we're, not, far, we're not too far off track. Uh, as you can see, the guys in the background from Ward High Tech are, are... Yeah, we've got Mick and Andy in the background, screwing away, marking up. Yeah, they're marking out all the floors for the, for the core drilling. It's obviously it's something that has to be very precise and you can't get wrong. So that just goes to show, once again, the level of support and commitment we're getting from these guys. Absolutely, and they've got a big job ahead of them, haven't they? Yeah, <laughs> and it's not only just the present. We have bought these seven machines off them, and uh, in the future, as the business grows, we may need more machinery. And, you know, we, we're looking at more of this as a partnership, uh, and, and it's worked really well. Uh, it's gone as smooth as it could go. Uh, we've not really had any hiccups at all.